All right, so those of you that have uh, come across what modules I have in my system, I've gotten some questions about what is the Maplin Voice Vandal. So the Voice Vandal is actually a kit that I bought some number of years ago from Maplin and um, built into this hand sanded, <coughs> professionally polished, uh, panel. And what this is is basically a digital delay with a feedback control, a rate control, but it's also got this distortion section which is really um, I guess the best way to describe the distortion is more of like a chopper effect and it's got these push button switches where you can select which frequency range you want the chopper effect to happen at the downfall of this module is the chopper section actually makes quite a bit of noise so if I turn the distortion up you may be able to hear the clock noise in the background this is not the quietest module but it is very functional so um, I'll start off by demonstrating the delay sound. That's my dry sound there. So let's turn up the uh, feedback and we'll turn up the rate a little bit. Pretty tight rate. We can make this thing really ring. Anyways, you do get that noise, and uh, I have modified this thing a couple times to completely remove the chopper circuit, but in the end, it came down to uh, not being as much of a pain when you've got it in the mix. You can't hear all that other uh, that 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 oscillation, but you can just remove that section from the kit if you are able to find one. But here's another little bit of a longer delay, about midnight on both. <laughs> up a little bit here. Feedback going, get the rate going, we can get some longer delays. Okay, so fair enough. Basically a, a, a delay. It's done with a, a unique digital memory chip. Um, not really your typical PT2399 or PT2395 digital uh, converted to warm sounding analog delay. But let's check out this chopper section. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, set the speed of the module to be very high. And we'll put it on the high selection here. And then we'll turn the, uh, let me see if I can get an arpeggio going. Something to hold, or a held note. Okay. Now if I turn the section off, it takes the sound out completely, but just that was the high, let's check the low out. Now you can hear I've got the delay going as well, so we can turn this basically off and hear that low again without the delay. So you really get, can get some cool cross-modulation sounds out of this. Um, you can also turn on all four sections.
So uh, some pretty interesting, neat effects you can get going with this. Um, if I turn that delay up again, let's just say we put feedback about 10 o'clock and leave the rate really sharp, you can get a kind of a suedo reverby type sound. <laughs> So that's it, that's the uh, Maplin Voice Vandal, and I have seen a couple couple places have this in their archive on the web, but it's been some time since I've seen the kit available. It does come with all the switches, all the knobs, a big, big, huge circuit board, and it will work with um, with 15 volts DC. I believe it works with up to 18, but uh, don't, don't quality check me on that, I'm probably wrong. Um, but a pretty cool module, and uh, I've thought about doing an MOTM panel for this, but you know what? It works, it's, it's got a nice look with the polished aluminum. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it as is. With the, even with the silver, uh, with black font brother labeling tape. Um, because nobody knew anything about panels nine years ago when I made this thing, anyways. Uh, thanks again. Appreciate you stopping by and checking out another one of my videos.